My name is Tim Biddle, and I, I am not an actor. I'm a real patient of Dr. White. Uh, I perhaps am not the most typical patient who had LASIK surgery because uh, my hobbies are very active. I primarily do offshore sailing in the ocean, uh, I scuba dive, and I ski. I talk to Dr. White off and on for probably eight to ten years before I did LASIK. Uh, my feeling about medical procedures is that if you can avoid a medical procedure, avoid it at all costs. Uh, in my particular case, uh, I frankly asked him a lot of, I think, very direct questions and very tough questions about the risks of LASIK, about his outcomes, and what I could reasonably expect. Uh, I'm doing this because I saw him in the health club a few weeks ago five weeks after I had had my LASIK surgery, five years after I had had my LASIK surgery. And I told him voluntarily that that was the best thing I had ever had done. Um, and it really had improved my life. Uh, as an example, uh, because I do sail offshore uh, for weeks at a time, uh, I had great trouble with my eyeglasses and with my contact lenses. Uh, it was a safety issue for me because I had to run watches on a 24-7 basis. On my first offshore trip after having LASIK, we in fact uh, had a crew member who lost his glasses in a storm and really became incapacitated. We just couldn't use him because he couldn't see to help us. Um, it honestly has been the best uh, procedure I've ever had. Uh, as an aside, and I didn't do it for this reason, but I actually figured out I was probably spending four to five hundred dollars a year on contact lenses and contact lens solutions, so I probably am close to a payback on this surgery by about now or by next year. Um, I encourage you to talk to Dr. White, ask him tough questions, ask him about what you can reasonably expect, and I think he'll give you very direct answers like I have. Um, thanks.